Hi Gemini, welcome to your reading and this is for Gemini Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus placement in their chart, Jupiter may resonate with the reading, cross watchers are always welcome, cross watchers if I discard someone and you know that it is not you, it is not you, just because you are connecting with Gemini you're gonna assume that whom I'm describing here is you, please don't, this is not a personal reading. For those of you who's new to the channel, welcome. You might want to um, click the subscribe button for I am doing a live streaming wherein you can ask me questions. If you missed the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There's a link in the description box. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading so gems if you would like to know your lucky numbers in lucky color follow me in instagram that's dated may the 1st to may the 7th and if you also want to know your financial forecast for the month of may follow me in instagram as well if you are into twin flame readings all most personal readings pick a card and channel messages Please subscribe to the other channel, that's Thomas Tarot 111 and if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, you can come back to the reading after a week or two, time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading, still congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. So gems, I would appreciate if you can click the like, subscribe, and share. At sa mga kababayan po natin, paki-click na lang din po ang subscribe, like, at paki-share ang video. So, first card is the High Priestess, the Sun, and the Five of Wands. It felt like to you, you know, your instinct felt like to me that you are, the universe is kind of like talking to you in a very, you know, subtle and very deep way it felt like you don't even have to ask a questions gems you know your intuitions are high thin um the universe is also telling you not to be biased with the situation you know um the those the pros and cons of the situations the positive and the negative you should be in balance um you know, for a fact, you know, I'm, I'm seeing here two kind of scenarios, whether it is for singles or um, in a relationship. For singles. I mean, it felt like to me, you're making excuses for your significant other. Um, you can see it in, I mean, you can feel it, that your person's getting a little cold. You can somehow probably you're seeing a post of a friend or of your significant other that they are with someone and you're trying to make excuses right felt like to me oh it's not true right for a few numbers of you what i'm seeing here is you are you're you're you're, you're you you're not seeing that but you have a feeling that your person might be that you might be in a third party situation or you might be in a competition with other people but you are not saying it yet right you're not divulging that information yet you kind of feel like your person's attention is with someone or something else right you're very strategic kind of i really wanted to know who this is if this is true what have you for the other parts of you, you know, for the other, um, for the partial collective who is trying to mix, to mix excuses, the answer is, you know, in your face, but you don't want to believe it. With the Six of Swords here and the Three of Swords, you know what, from what I am seeing here, everything is going to a calmer water if you're going to continue, you know, blinding yourself. You're going to be hurt here, right? With the strength cards, um, we know for a fact that there's no communication or less communication here. Uh, with the three of wands, probably you're just waiting, right? For the right time, waiting for your ship to come in. 
waiting for that final moment for you to see it with the knight of wands and the seven of pentacles seven of pentacles is kind of you already planted your seed you already exerted an effort the universe is telling you to might as well continue and move with whatever the um actions that you are doing right listen to that intuition so this is you um for those cross watchers who feels like in this situation so be it gems if you feel like you will be in this um side that's okay i am not reading which side you at i am reading the energy but it felt like to me that this um third party is someone from the past that is true um someone from the past they connected with it's either a person you know or an event that your person tied up with um kind of like they already agreed with uh with that event situation what have you so they're focusing on that right but with the five of ones it's actually really a person so this is someone from their past um, I think that the past year, the third party, you know, something is growing in the third party. And I think that this was announced, you know, um, I, I'm not saying that you are a rebound because they already committed to you. Um, but what I am seeing here with the judgment, you know, your person is in the middle of a hard decision. Um, who are they going to choose? Because the past here it could be a past person you know a person that they connected with didn't went to fruition now you are the person that they're dealing with and the past year is trying to come back so you are really in a third party situation with a judgment and the three of cups and the knight of pentacles i can see here that you will be in a stagnant position for a little while here but with the three of cups you know um yes it's given three of cups is a double-edged card it can it can mean a third party which was blatantly um in the energy but also three of cups is a representation of a celebration so i can see here that there may be a stagna uh, stagnation in this situation but i can see a celebration in the future especially with the sun with you on your um on your side so you might be connecting here with of course um the year or has a leo placement in their chart or you have a leo placement in your chart um taurus or has a taurus placement in their chart or you have a taurus placement in your chart libra or has a libra placement in their chart or you have a libra placement in your chart a lot of leos here any water placements any fire sign also so this is your reading. If you resonate with this and you want to go in-depth, you can book a personal reading with me. If you are okay with this reading and you just have a question or two, there is a link in the description box. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading. So thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you on the next reading. Goodbye, gems.